I'm sitting here looking at my friend Rylan, and he's got a cute, squashy face. But I've just been filled up. What are you going on about? I yeah. can't even move it. Yeah, well. <laughs> Have you been filled up? Of course I have. Look at me. <laughs> <laughs> at least I'm honest, guys. Thank yeah, you. This sounds great outside. I know, it's nice. Everyone who's walking past Television Centre oh, today is in for a real treat. <laughs> oh, Lord. Here he is. Here we go. Earlier, we're going to get you on the show straight away. I've been here. I see these shenanigans. You two banging things in the middle of it. Got these. Just to shut is him up. Is this my time now? No, no not yet. No. no, no, no. His head could be in between those, couldn't it? <laughs> it will be in a minute. Yeah. I was born in the wrong era, yeah. I think. What year were you born? 88. Oh, I see. This is about 85, 86. And I'm 86. just waiting for the tweets to say I look older. Yeah, go on. I'm ready. I'm ready for it. No, not with all that Botox. <laughs> <laughs> you look... I couldn't tell. Everything. Well, anyway. Uh, when you think of all the toys that we should have taken better care of. I know, think of how much money they'd be yeah, worth now. That's what you're thinking that. about. Old yeah. Antiques Roadshow, you. No, I'm thinking about how to get <laughs> radiant-looking skin this summer. I knew you I was. I was thinking of that. I knew you was. was. Absolutely thinking of that. Yeah. And uh, if you're thinking the same, don't go anywhere, because Charlotte Tilbury will share her secrets to the perfect golden it's glow. Look beautiful. You've got this. These are a bit bigger than the ones that we use at the end of a massage, you know, those yeah. things. <laughs> <laughs> are you ready? Are you ready? Oh, my God. It's great. It gets your hair. It blew your hair. <laughs> oh, my God. We're, uh, wow. we're, we're in, we're that in practice. That woke me up. Uh, oh, that was the uh, band of the belt. RAF regiment playing uh, the Royal Air Force March. Uh, they're joining us this morning ahead of Armed Forces Day on Saturday. Uh, they've set us a challenge. Myself and Philip will be joining them a little later to take part in a very special performance. That's if we can master our instruments on time. I mean, when exactly are we going to get to rehearse with these things? We're not, are we? Look, well, th that was this it, Is this it? Think. And I, don't, I have no idea what the music is that we're going to be performing to. Apparently it's like from The Greatest Showman. Uh, well, that'll be all right. Then. I'll just sing. I mean, I'll sing. Going, no, I mean, I'm good at that. No, 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 please don't. <laughs> <laughs> There's no need for that. All right. <laughs> uh, so, right, ready? Just a little bit here. Duh, 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 duh. Stop. Go with those, and I'll give you the thing. All right, right ready? I'll ready? do it. Ready? Here we go. Duh. We are good. Oh, we are. We've good. got no problem. We are very good. Ruth Stavi was a beekeeper. What's he? Yes, explains a lot. Okay, fine. Yes, because I mean, if you if you're stung by them. You see, do you think bees are as cuddly <laughs> as their image would suggest? I don't trust them. I think they're plotting. There's, there's something going on with the bees. I know they're good for us and the pollination, and we'll speak to Archie about that, and that's all fantastic. But one day, mark my words, they'll come for us, and they'll come for us all. We will be crossing live and discussing that very subject with a five-year-old very, very shortly. Don't trust me. I filmed all the way through peace and I met this beautiful lady called Margherita. Mm. She, uh, she... I love her pizzas. Like the pizza. Mm. She runs a restaurant in her house, OK? And uh, uh, so people go there, they pay 10 uh, euro, and uh, they spend the evening with her cooking. And, uh, and <laughs> she, I was there as well for the whole evening, and she teach me how to do this uh, beautiful gra grand... Uh, oh, uh, yeah, that yeah. one. Uh, Moose, and I thought, I'm going to take you back to this morning because you guys are going to love it. OK, so. well, we shall try that later. Thank you very much. Well, I've got no time for any of that. It's Lucy <laughs> in it now. <laughs> so, Celine Dion will be sharing her superstar beauty secrets now. But is this Celine Dion on the Shush. show? She'll be taking part in our big musical challenge at 11.40. Lisa's here with her pick of the best stylish swimwear at midday. And we've got a double helping of Gene. In fact, we've already had one. <laughs> uh, he'll be talking to us on the sofa in about ten minutes. Is Celine Dion and on the show, yes or no? He's back to cook his Italian summer dessert at 12.15. Viewers at home... What are you going to say? I'm just going to... Well, if you are, you know, are... Pregnant. Pregnant. I was going to say something else, but I never remember which... Up the which... fluff is what you normally say. That's what you said to I me. I was going to say up the muff, but that no. is completely wrong. Uh, although technically it's right, it's wrong to say. So, um, we put this one here. Oh, After sorry. two hours, goes in here. Yes. Yeah. Go on, apologise. I know you won't apologise <laughs> no, on my I'm behalf. I'm not going to. I know you won't apologise on my behalf. No, 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 not going okay. to. I'm not going to. <laughs> OK. There's nothing to apologise because that was scientifically correct. <laughs> Thank you. So, see, I, this is what I mean. What's a duff? Stop no, it. Someone no, 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 needs no, no, to no, tell no, me. No, 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 no
What's a duff? It's yes. The, the, it's, it's how he senders end. It's the beats at the end of his senders. <laughs> we both went there somebody, at the same somebody time. Somebody try one. OK. All about that. I didn't know there was going to be another Chinese It's about the third one now, isn't think it? I think it is. I think it is. Oh, good luck to him. Yeah. Uh, and back... Our I'm so... at Majors, Jacqueline Smith. No, see, I was um, the Cameron Diaz, Lucy Liu era. Era. Well, that's OK. We, we, you know, Independent I, women. That's why we cover all things on this programme. Between you and me. I, I mean, we could take over the world but not with the base. Right. And we're going to be talking about heads turning through jealousy. Oh. Jealousy, as if your head would turn, as if there's anything there that would turn <laughs> anybody's turn. head. Um, anyway, I'm not a man to be turned <laughs> in any way. Uh, <laughs> All right, you're safe. Deirdre. Deirdre, what do you want to hear about today? Yeah, well, it's true. There are all these newcomers coming to Love Island. and But, you know, all of us, we, in a way, live on our own Love Island, don't we? So is there someone who's come into your life that maybe has turned your head and you're thinking, hmm, you know, that, that could be a good prospect? Or are you worried that someone's come into your partner's life and is turning their head and their eye is straying? So any worries you've got in your relationship about someone's head being turned, about jealousy and betrayal, we're here to help. Do you think Ruth's head could be turned? Do you know, my wife is quite dull that way. She's not, you know, she's quite, you know, she's quite fixated on me. I mean, I sort of understand... She's what world me. do you live in? Well, I'll tell you what the world is. If you've got steak at home, why go out for a hamburger? That's really what I say. Paul Newman quote, yeah. We, 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 we're, we're calling this steak, are we? Are we? Anyway, she's happy. Put it that way. She's happy. <laughs> yeah, give us a ring. Give us a call for free on 08,000 30, 40, 44. Or download our free this morning app and click Get Involved. Make sure you leave your contact number. You need to be in touch by 11.15 today and you must be 18 or over. You are definitely of sirloin. Do you know what you are? What? Is that, well, you're a bit of double... Fillet. A certainly sirloin, Philip. You're a double bubble. Do you know what you are? Naughty. Oh, Naughty. And I... oh welcome back. Um, we were looking at something this morning, wasn't we? And why, you, why are you remaining quiet? Because you loved this chat we had this morning. Well, these were chat-up lines. It was chat-up lines, because it was in the papers this morning, and it's the death of the chat-up line, which I think is quite well, it sad. it won't die as long as you're around. What do you mean? Because you're full of all those old hammy lines. I have got, I, I, I've got quite right, a good go one. On, try me out. Go okay, on. Right, go, grab my arm. Grab my arm. What's that? What's that? It's your shirt. Boyfriend material, that is. <laughs> you like that? You like that? Oh, you've gone red! You've gone red! Maybe you are for turning. <laughs> <laughs> we, we were literally having such a laugh about uh -huh. this this morning when we were getting ready. Uh -huh. So many of you have been getting in touch with your chat-up lines because a survey has found men are now too worried about using them in case it's deemed inappropriate. And let's be honest, some of them can be quite... Well, it is inappropriate. I mean, here's Jo. Jo's a woman. Jo says, ex ex here's her line, which I think is inappropriate. Excuse me, but I'm new to the area. Right. Could you give me directions to your house? Well, that's a bit <laughs> that's forward, creepy. Joe. That's a bit creepy, that I, I, one, Jonathan. I, I, I mean, if I'd had a few that. drinks, I wouldn't even know directions, Simona. Um, oh, Stephanie's one, straight to the point. What do you want for breakfast in the morning? <laughs> Nat says, one guy in a taxi queue told me he had a tin of all-day breakfast and would I like to come back to his to share it in the morning? I'm, I'm going to read out Kevin's because normally I wouldn't, but someone's let it come through on the comments. Kevin says... <laughs> No, don't. <laughs> no, please, don't. don't. Shall I? Take it from me. Take it as your father figure speaking here. Do not read that out, right? <laughs> Unless you want to be sacked. I'm only here part forget, time. No, now. forget that one. Forget that one. I love uh, it. I really want to read it. Uh, I really want to read it. Uh, Steph said, I got told by an oh, elderly man. No, no, no. No, no I can't. No, no. No. Why are these coming through to the They're rude and they're inappropriate. Um, oh, this is okay. Chelsea said, Is your dad a boxer? Because you're a knockout. Oh, stop it. Oh, yeah. Jade said, I'd give you a nine out of ten, and I'm the one you need. <laughs> Do you get it? That's mm. a maths one. You won't get it, maths. <laughs> well, look, you're so naughty. Just, I, I don't, don't start I don't, on me. I'll I get so I don't care on you. if it leaves you scarred. Oh, yeah. Here's a nice one. Gemma, fancy going offs on a baby? <laughs> <laughs> These are all a bit... All I really... Do you know what? They're all a bit... Part of me thinks, you know what, it's worth the sack to read a couple of these No, it's out. not. It's not. It's not. It's not. <laughs> and what are we talking about now? Are we're we doing it? About... I'm frightened. I'm a little bit worried. Well, that's why they're there in Europe I know, here. but there's definitely no bees here, is there? <laughs> no, because we used to no. have the this morning bees, didn't we? Where did they go?
They went in there. They don't they do that. that, honey. They made don't that, do honey. It. Don't do it. Don't yeah. do it. We right. It's actually handsome. wearing my uh, my range in on the left. I just Is thought, it? Yeah, I'm, I was really happy with that. I know I'm not allowed to say it, but I'm if I'm sure seen... you're allowed to say that, and other ranges are available. Yeah, other ranges are, but I felt like I had to. I felt like I had to. <laughs> um, so then, obviously. <laughs> That honey is nice, though. It's lovely. I know what you mean by that grassy taste, but it's like floral taste, isn't it? It is. It's just like grass. Beautiful. Do you know when you talk to producers, you say, he's only five, can he talk? Oh, he's wonderful. He never shuts up. He never shuts up. <laughs> Are you sure, honestly? We have Proper chat. He's just never Love keeps him. quiet. Love it down the line. But he's obviously a smart boy. Oh, he knows what he's doing. Hello, look, he's, he's, he's sold about 60,000 of them. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, babe. We love <laughs> you, Fleur. Thank you very much. Stop calling everybody beard. <laughs> she is a babe. But it doesn't mean you can't do that nowadays. You I can. can. No, I can say what I like to Fleur. Yeah. Well, you said, would you me like Fleur to... very close. Well, Hillary she hear what she calls me. Look at her. She might mm. look all sweetness and light. No, yeah. No. Yeah, we know about Fleur. When you called Hillary Clinton beard, I thought that was a... Oh, stop. I'm, I'm annoyed with her. That was a stop. She stepped too far. No, I'm annoyed Why? with Why? Hillary. Why? Why? She was in London last night. Didn't, didn't call you? Didn't ring me. What says, have I done? Says it all. What have I done, but You need to get in touch by 11.15. You've only got five minutes and you must be 18 or over. But you've only got four minutes, actually. It's 11.11. 11. I'm just saying, there's no point telling people the five Why minutes. Why are you like that? Because there would be a minute over and they wouldn't get on. Yeah, but do you know what? If they're going to be that pedantic about a minute, I, I ain't got the time for it. You're so naughty. I... <laughs> so... <laughs> Isn't it? Da, 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 it's Charlie's da, Angels. Da, da. Is that Charlie's Angels? No. Well, what's that? <laughs> We've both got it wrong. Oh, yeah, that's it. It is that's that. It. it is that. Isn't it? Yeah. I hope so. Yeah. Do you know what's his name? Uh, Charlie, of course, was... Of Charlie's Angels fame. Yes, he was the guy who... And I'm sorry I started this story. So am I. Uh, Blake Carrington. He was Blake Carrington in Dynasty. You never saw him. Cool story, bro. Yeah, and then Bosley, oh. he was the one like me. Great. Really. Sam Rubin, got him very shortly. He'll have all the latest on this. Sam, we, we, he, Sam's just ready to enlighten <laughs> us and everything. Can you sing the Charlie's Angels theme tune, can you? I can't quite sing it, but it's John Forsythe who you're thinking of. It was Blake John Harrison's Forsythe, voice. yeah, yeah. I had dinner with John Forsythe. Of course you did. I did. I've got to ask, uh, is it art? Because it's Walmart there, isn't it? Oh, so I just want to take my clothes off, babe. Do I it. Get, I just want to get naked. Do it. Go on. I'll give you a tenner. <laughs> Maybe later. <laughs> uh, later. Really, tenner. Yeah. Later. I will yeah. then. Very yeah. good. Be good. Enjoy, enjoy the rest of your trip. Thank you very much indeed for details of that great competition. 300,000 quid. Goodness me. Mm, it's time for a bit of showbiz now. I like a bit of showbiz. Listen to this. What? Here we are. Listen to this. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know why I'm doing that. Hello, angels. Yeah. Let's... That's enough. That's enough. That's enough. But I'm glad. Yours was a wee bit more like Tales of the Unexpected, you know, but then so? that was Charlie's Angels. I still got actually. it. Uh, Charlie, we've got to go. Or Sam, sorry. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you for <laughs> bringing us all that lovely stuff about uh, Charlie's Angels and the, uh, the movie uh, coming back. I mean, I remember from the 70s, you remember Charlie's Angels from the early noughties. Yeah. And... Well, just reliving it. Thank goodness there's no words to that song anyway. Lots more for you on the way, including Deirdre taking your calls and having your head turned. Your head's turned. There's something wrong with you, totally. There is. We'll find out after this.